Dragon Age, the Veil Guard gets Mage Deep Dive and Blighted Dragon gameplay. During yesterday's State of Play broadcast, BioWare premiered two new Dragon Age, the Veil Guard videos. One is a deep dive on the Mage class, and another is dedicated to a boss fight against a Blighted Ice Dragon. Producer Hilary Heidi walked Dragon Age, the Veil Guard fans through her process of building the Mage character, as a Mage. I can switch between two weapon sets, a staff for ranged attacks or an elemental orb and dagger for close quarter combat. I'm facing off against an ice dragon, which is vulnerable to fire, so I've equipped the meal sash as my elemental orb. It reduces enemy damage, makes burning less longer and do more damage, and increases the cap of burning stacks. My dagger, Thorn of Misfortune gives me access to the physical damage type and synergizes with my affliction based build, increasing the damage of arcane bombs, which I build up with repeated arb attacks. I further powered up my afflictions by equipping this death mask, which will give me a nice damage boost. Let's switch to my Dragon Age, the Veil Guard character skill tree, where I further enhanced my ability to take on this ice dragon. Elemental Catalyst gives my abilities plus 15% bonus damage, in this case, fire damage, since both my staff and arb are fire based. Inner Focus generates 25% extra mana from successful light attacks, and that number is doubled against enemies suffering from an affliction, like burning, so each time I attack my burning enemies, I'll generate 50% extra mana allowing me to cast powerful spells like Meteor more often. The Spellblade specialization blends magic and melee. With the Electrical Burns passive, my fire attacks stack even more afflictions on my targets, applying the Shocked Affliction whenever I apply burning, and vice versa. Finally, my Spellblade ultimate ability Thunderous and unleashes a massive amount of damage, shocking enemies in a wide radius. The Dragon Age the Veil Guard producer goes on to show some synergizes and combos with the companions. Once the dragon is stag, Gaird, she primes the Sundered status with Lucanese and triggers it with her own character. Normally, she would have to wait a few seconds until Lucanese's ability is once again available, but the regroup rune instantly refreshes companions' cooldowns, allowing her to repeat the combo right away. The dragon is then finished off with the aforementioned ultimate ability, Thunder Ascend. Dragon Age, The Veil Guard is out on October 31st. Check out our recent coverage, including the hands-on preview, exclusive Kanda, and roundtable group Kanda.